Hi, I'm Rod. Welcome to my channel. Today I am listening to Kate Bush perform Hounds of Love. And this is the official music video. So here we go. She's in the tree. It's coming. When I was a child, running in the night, afraid of what I might be, hiding in the dark, hiding in the street, and the world was full of enemies. The homes of love are haunting. I've always been speaking with cows. So that was um, Kate Bush and Hounds of Love. Um, I really like the vocals in this song and the drums driving the song along. Um, it's not my favourite Kate Bush song. I prefer her more, I guess what could be called arty kind of songs. Um, this to me seems just like a, almost a straight up pop song. Um, but her, her vocals are great. As far as the song itself goes, I think it's a song about um, being afraid to fall in love. And in the song, that, that feeling of fear is um, compared to being chased by a, a pack of hounds. A um, bit, bit about uh, Kate Bush and the song. Uh, Kate Bush is an English singer, 
songwriter, record producer and dancer. In 1978, at the age of 19, she topped the UK singles chart for four weeks with her debut single, Wuthering Heights, becoming the first female artist to achieve a UK number one with a self-written song. Bush has since released 25 UK top 40 singles, including uh, top 10 hits. Hounds of Love is the f fifth studio album by Bush. It was released on the 16th of September 1985 by EMI Records. Hounds of Love is a song written and produced and performed by English art rock singer Kate Bush. It is the title track and the third single released from her number one studio album, Hounds of Love. The single was released on the 24th of February 1986 and reached number 18 in the UK singles chart. In October 2004, Q magazine placed this song at number 21 in its list of 50 greatest British songs of all time. The song was performed live for the first time as part of the 2014 Before the Dawn residency in which the lyrics were slightly altered. English post-punk band The Future Heads covered the song in 2005, scoring a UK top 10 hit with it. So it was listed as number 21 on the list of 50 greatest British songs of all time. I wonder if any of her other songs got higher than that. Um, so clearly Wuthering Heights was a bigger hit um, and I preferred the song Wuthering Heights to this. Um, but anyway, uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did and you would like to support the channel, the best way to do that is by liking, subscribing and commenting. It all helps. And I hope to see you in another video soon. Thanks for watching.